UFC legend Kimbo Slice has passed away. He was 42 years old down in South Florida. The larger-than-life charismatic figure was a legend in UFC. He was famous, though, with his bare-knuckle fights down in South Florida, even in his backyard. He was a legend in South Florida as a fighter. He was scheduled to fight in London on July 16th. So it was a big surprise when he was admitted to the hospital on Monday near his home in Coral Springs, Florida. His real name was Kevin Ferguson. He was a mixed martial artist. As I said, he was a larger-than-life charismatic figure. He was a legend in the UFC. He passed away on Monday night, June 6th, 2016. Now the rumors are already flying around. First there was Prince. Then there was Muhammad Ali. And now there's Kimbo Slice. The rumors are that the chemtrails are coming down on people and it's too much for their immune system. That could be the fact. With somebody like Muhammad Ali, his immune system is compromised. Yes, the chemtrails could have been a factor. But what I'm here to tell you is the doctors are being controlled by the Illuminati. The doctors are being controlled by the globalists. If the doctors want to keep their license, if the doctors want to keep their mansions, then they're going to play the game. They're going to do exactly what the globalists tell them to do. And the globalists don't want you to know that the superbug is out in force. Now we know that they said that Prince died of drug overdose. That's going to be the cover story from today going forward. A lot of these people like Prince, I don't know what the cover story will be for Kimbo, but the cover story going forward with the globalist is they'll use the drug overdose cover story. In fact, the superbug is out and it is scary. The superbug is in every hospital. The superbug is in the oceans. The superbug is in all the dirty water. The superbug is in the gymnasiums, the workout centers, the high schools. The superbug is everywhere, and they don't want you to know this. The globalists are keeping this a secret. Some people even say that there are laboratories that are making the superbug even stronger. I'm here to tell you that we're being lied to. Yes, mainstream media is nothing but a shell for the globalist. The globalist put the press release out. The prostitutes report on it. And everybody believes it. Like today. Everybody believes that old poor Prince died of a drug overdose. Cover story. The globalists don't want you to know about this modified superbug that no drugs will kill. There are no antibiotics to kill this superbug. And if you go to the hospital, for whatever reason, you try to get your little tummy tuck, you get a back operation, you get cosmetic surgery, they don't want you to know that that $10,000 procedure could give you the modified superbug and you won't make it. I'm telling you, if this superbug gets into your open wound, you will not make it. You will go quick. Monday, it, that's how quick it was for Kimbo. Monday, and then boom, he's gone. The superbug don't mess around. I mean, if you go in for that little cosmetic surgery because they tell you you ain't pretty enough, so you go in and you give the doctor $10,000, and he's going to supposedly make you prettier. Only one problem, if you catch the superbug, if it gets into the cut, you're gone, you're dead. Be happy with yourself. Be happy with yourself. Tell those cosmetic doctors that you know where. They can go you know where. And they can stay in their mansions. And you stay in your home. And you stay away from the superbug. And all will be well. Trust me. They're lying to us. Mainstream media is lying to you. They get the press release from the corporations, they get the press, they get the prostitutes to repeat it. The globalists are lying to us. The superbug is out there. Beware.